um, I do every week. I wait a couple minutes to wait till everyone gets online. Um, say hi when you join in. I'd love to know who's on. And today, well, I haven't washed my hair since last week, but I did curl it with a curling iron. So we will see here. Let's see here. Ooh. I'm put on some music. Any suggestions? Let me know. Um, what's going on? Happy Easter to everyone. Uh, let me see. Oh, here we go. So, ah. always the beginning is a little bit of a struggle. But we're going to get this. How's everyone doing today? I'm gonna put on some music. And get started. Hey, Margaret. Huh, one of you say you can't see. All right. And play. Well, today uh, it's Easter, and we're all celebrating from home. Um, I will be doing a ooh, too loud. I will be doing half a poodle because um, I'm trying to fix. I've been trying to fix my curling iron that I've had for many years. Oh, uh, favorite yet? But um. So I wasn't able to finish my whole hair. So good thing I finished the first half. I need to get a new one. As you can tell, this is so old. So I'll be showing you half a poodle. It's still the same concept for your whole hair. Um, but I like to have it curly because it's so much easier. I still have my wet set from last week on since I'm not really doing uh, many activities or going out. And my hair is not really oily. So I'll be putting my hair back in a snood. But for now, I'm gonna clip it back to get it out of the way. Thank you, Daniel. So, um, let's get started here. So I pink curled my hair with the curling iron that is in curling iron heaven. Oh, that's gonna pop out. Okay, let me not touch that. So in my look today, I decided to film a YouTube video creating a spring look using only the items in a boxy charm box. And I'm using eyeshadow as lipstick today. So that's exciting to see if it lasts. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I put some hairspray after I curled it just to set these curls in place. And I'm gonna take them off. We're gonna take it all off. And, and just like the, and you can also do this with a wet set, any type of set. Um, so, if your hair is oily or it's like me, you haven't washed it. I am going to put some dry shampoo on the roots before I brush it out. Now for this poodle look, I don't really brush out as much as I did for my brush out. So we're just going to take it off. Thank you, Danielle. I'm letting my roots... Uh, and hair kind of relax for a bit um, during this quarantine. Whoop. Well, that went right into my bag. So, oh, that feels good. So 
So I'm just gonna put some dry shampoo on the roots. Um, you can use any dry shampoo. There's not really a brand that's better than the other. So from far away, because I don't want my hair to look like powder. Just a bit. Oh, I forgot one in the back. So if how are, how are all of you celebrating Easter at home? Are you cooking something special? Dressing up? I'm loving seeing the people that do um, dinner themes. My favorite one was um, Tiger King dinner theme and like family dressed up as a character. I like the Disney character ones or people that recreate Disney rides at home. They've been fun to watch. So I'm gonna use one of these combs and I'm gonna go section by section well, Margaret hid eggs all over the house for her son to find. Oh, that's cute! I've seen people do it with dogs. If they live with a dog, they put like doggy treats and then the dog just goes crazy all day. I wanted to try that, but I don't have any eggs. So I'm gonna tease the root. Well, you know what? No, I'm not gonna do that. I'm doing a poodle. I'm gonna bring all the hair to the top. Brush out with your fingers. Gently. You don't wanna make any kinks. Now, for this hairstyle, you're gonna use a lot of bobby pins. But you see, it's already forming once we put it up here. But I'm gonna take some pomade. I'm using the Lady Luck pomade. one side and then one side so we're gonna brush get a smooth drop all my bobby pins and I'm gonna put two bobby pins hidden underneath this craziness And let the curls cascade over it to cover it. And then there are like different ways you could cheat on a poodle. Like if you don't like doing your hair, they do sell on Amazon like extensions that look like a little rectangle. I think some of you ladies have them and you just pick your hair up and clip it. Also good if you feel like you don't have a lot of hair. And you could dye them. So a lot of girls that you see with poodles they might just have a fake poodle. So here I'm just putting pomade. I'm brushing. And then get two bobby pins. One going in the front and one going in from the back. And these won't be seen and you could put your poodle sideways or in the middle I'm going for the middle now I don't mind it being loose in the back because I want it to cover in the back so then you see how it's shaping up it's like a 80s music video now the one thing I noticed that I didn't have around my house is an invisible hairnet so that would really complete the look at the end to make it stay but now here, it's all about getting your fingers wet with the pomade and then placing your curls as you need. So that's why a good set, and separating it to create more curls. Now if you have thin hair, this is what you will Get your back comb and tease it a bit to create volume. You can make it as big as you like. And then here is literally just playing with it. Now 
another trick to doing a poodle is you could do a really high ponytail and then with your um, curling iron, you could curl and then place your curls and separate them as needed. I've done that when I'm like overslept. Um, but I feel like doing it this way creates a better... Well, I'm not showing... Uh, I mean, Margaret, I'm not um, just showing you how I do it. Uh, it all begins with a good base, just like makeup. Uh, you got to make sure you wash your face and take care of your face. That way your makeup looks nice. And now the poodle hairstyle name came out of um, the dog, the poodle dog, you know, creating curls on your face, representing the poodle. Now the, the hair section that I pay attention to the most is the one on my, like closest to the front. Cause I like to create, mm, like, okay, let's just work on the back first. And if you feel like maybe your hair is too long, like back here, I'd get a bobby pin and pin it just to make it feel uniform. And pomade is the trick here. These. So if you do your whole hair, you know, that's not staying. <laughs> okay. Let's make it smaller. I think here I'm going to use a bobby pin and try to stick it in between so you don't see it. I just like creating like three curls here in the front just to hold the look together. It keeps falling. If any of you have any questions, let me know. Because this is literally playing around with it. And it's a great hairstyle to... So. And another thing you could do is you could do a faux Betty bang with the front section to very different dimensions and then putting a hair flower let me see if I've got any in this room thank you Victoria <laughs> so let's see if so different ways you could like accessorize this is you could do with a a scarf. No, no, no scarf. A hat. You see, pin your hat down. How I would pin this hat down is I sewed in elastics with a little comb. And then you put it in. You know what I forgot? I forgot um, the back of my head. <laughs> so for the back of your head, if you do a half poodle, if you do the whole poodle, which is great for hot days, if you live in, in South Florida or anywhere that's really hot, 
You could either comb it. And, you know, that's one way. Comb it all around. Have your hair down. It looks straight. Curl it looks good curly or straight. You could put a hair flower that I don't have in this room, but let me get one to show you. So you could put a hair flower on one side. And there you go. Really gives that 1940s vibe with a matching um, flower brooch, you know? If you're really into arts and crafts, that would be really cute. Um, and I'm gonna complete this one with a snood. I love these snoods. I'm gonna put all your hair in the back. Oh look, I forgot to put a curl. We're just gonna brush that one back. So then we're gonna put this hey Vivian. Here it on the back. I try to spread it out for everything to fit or to look fuller. It reminds me of my um, Spaniard roots. I like to pin the top of the snood and then on the side. I feel like this is the quickest look I've done on the Facebook live series with Rockabilly. Um, do any of you have any questions? I could redo anything. Margaret, let me know. And then you set it with some hairspray. And if you really want it to last long, just put an invisible hairnet over this patch. Nobody will see it unless you're like this close to you. Um, I didn't think it was going to be this fast. I'm sorry. <laughs> hey, Jean. Yeah, these flowers, I didn't pin them in. They're literally from Joanne. I get one of those big things for like $12 and then I cut them up into little pieces. And that way you could add more or less. That's what I do when I put on my hats. Um, I could bobby pin it, but it's staying in there for now. But yeah, you just, you know, you could either buy clips, um, make them, or just, usually all the hair flowers I use in my hair are just pieces of flowers that I like to coordinate according to what I'm wearing. Um, Any other questions? Is there something that you want me to do next week? I know somebody requested the poodle last week. Um, anything else you'd like me to do next week? I've done the victory rolls, a wet set. Uh, the first week that I did these lives, I did a pin up makeup tutorial of how I do my makeup. There's a copy on it on the Rockability Facebook page and on my YouTube channel. Uh, let's see. I think somebody wanted last week how to do finger waves. Is that something you guys are still interested in? That'll be a challenge. I haven't done that in a long time. Bye.
Roxy. Say hi. Come here. Say hi, Victoria. Swoop tutorial. Oh, I could do a swoop tutorial. Finger waves and soup tutorial. Oh, bumper bang. I could do bumper bang. I could do swoop and bumper bang next week. Well, ah, okay. With a bob? With a bob? Do you have bangs? Because if you don't have bangs with a bob, you could do the, the faux bang. Um, and you could do the swoop. So next week, I'll do the faux bang and a swoop. And then the week after that, I'll do finger waves. And that way, um, you guys will have a little bit of everything. And if you're interested to see how I did this look, I just had fun today for Easter creating a look with only using stuff that came out of this boxy charm. It's on my YouTube channel. Oh, uh, will be on my YouTube channel. Curly tutorial. I would need somebody in my household to have curly hair. Um, but for example, if you have curly hair and you wanna do a poodle Victoria, you literally do the same thing. You don't even have to, your, your curls are very defined so you could just brush them all up and put an invisible hair in it and just with some pomade on your fingers you know, style it as you like. It'll look really pretty. And you can put all of it up when it gets really hot when you visit South Florida. And then with a bob, you can do finger waves too, now that I think about it. So I think for today, it was short and sweet because it's a holiday. That's what I'm saying. And um, I'll see you next week for the faux bang. And what, what did we agree? <laughs> the faux bang and the swoop. Uh, if you guys see when I have my hair down, I have a swoop. And then the week after that, it's gonna be the finger waves. Yeah, I'm from South Florida, Sherry. Thank you all for watching and thank you all for taking a moment of your Easter to hang out with me and I hope you guys learned something new. Um, if not the poodle, how to accessorize. Next week, stay tuned, we're going to do a faux bang and I'm going to show you how to do it with a rat and with out it, with teasing. Um, I like to use it with the fake rat because there's no teasing but i'm going to show you both in case you don't have one or the other or if you want to tease or you don't want to tease and then um i hope you guys have a lovely easter and i hope all of you are well and your families are well and i will see you next week bye thank you